format it so you cancel. You open Explorer 360, open the hard drive or mem card, click on partition zero, and there you can see all the stuff I have on my my thumb drive. I've got some exploit files, some game save files I use to move stuff around from Xbox to Xbox. I got a couple of Xboxes in my house. And on the left I've got CoinOp 6 Lite. Now CoinOp 6 Lite is actually too big for a thumb drive, so it's 4.6 gigabytes. So what I'm going to do is transfer it over without the videos, which uh, the videos alone are around 2 gigabytes. And then you can go back and add whatever videos you want. Um, you could always, you know, coin up six. You don't have to add all the ROMs or the games. You could only add a couple of the games. But, I, you know, that's up to you. So th there's a little bit of uh, variations you could do here. You could either just not add the videos or add just a couple videos or maybe add half the games. Okay. So. I just have the, the same things here, so I'm just going to move the videos folder. I'm actually just going to cut it and paste it over here so there's no videos folder there. And then I'm just going to put in a new, add a new folder here called, called videos. Of course, it doesn't have anything in it where the other videos folder had all of these really cool videos in it and I think I'm going what I'll do is I'll just put the like the 1941 I'll just put the first you know few videos over so I'll just copy those and, and paste those in so that way you'll have a few videos so you can see to see the premise here see how it works so I haven't deleted the videos from my um, from my install. I've just trimmed basically trimmed these down to where now there's only a few videos there, and instead of two gigabytes, you're looking at 35 megabytes. So this will fit no problem. So I'm going to um, inject this onto the partition zero. So I just click it, drag it to partition zero, and let it go. Now this is going to take a while. I think because it's um, a couple of gigabytes. So I'm just going to maybe pause the video here and I'll tell you how long it took when it's done. Okay, that took a long time actually. Um, that took an hour and a half maybe so to uh, inject those files. So if I now just go to drive, open, hard drive or mem card, partition zero, so their coin op 6 light is on there and all the files and everything are there. Um, <clears throat> so now I'm going to eject this and pop it into the Xbox and see if we can't load it on there for you. So let's see how that goes. Okay, now we're back at the Xbox. I've got my adapter and the thumb drive. I'm going to plug it in. Can, uh, I'll just show you there's nothing there's nothing on this Xbox yet. If you go to File Explorer, let's put this under emus for emulators. Go to the CoinOps 6 Lite folder, hit the start button on your Xbox, and then copy. And it's telling you you want to copy all these files and just say OK. And this is going to take a little bit of time because it's such a big file. It actually says on the bottom, if you zoom in, let's see, remaining 39 minutes. So this is a long way to do it. Um, FTPing is definitely a lot quicker and you can also use a DVD to burn it. But if you don't want to FTP or you can't FTP, you can actually do this with your thumb drive. So I'm just going to pause the video and I'll let you know when it's done. I'll come back to it. Okay guys, it's uh, what about 45 minutes later and it looks like it successfully transferred the files. 
from the thumb drive over. So I just hit A, and then your back button, and then you're back at your uh, back at your main drive. And you might be able to notice there on the E partition, there's only 2.2 gigabytes or uh, 2,200 megabytes left. So uh, everything's been transferred now. Under the emulators, it's not going to show up yet because you you have to reboot your Xbox in order for it to show up, just like anything else. So I'm going to give it a soft boot real quick, and there we go. There's a soft boot. Now if we go down to emulators. Coin Ops Six will show up. Hit the A button. And we'll load it up. So I'm just going to adjust the screen size here. So I hit the start button, go down to screen size. I'm just going to adjust that so you can see a little better. Okay, and then 10 yard flight doesn't seem to be on there, but there's the video for the 1941s, like I said, and the 42. So the videos are on there, just for those few ones. Uh, but you've got all 500 games that are in Coin Ops Lite. You just don't have the videos for everything because <clears throat> they all wouldn't fit onto the thumb drive. So if you wanted to go back and add um, more videos, just go back and add them.